This is a quick video on how to center things in Bootstrap Studio like images and text. Um, it also applies to um, anything else as well um, without Bootstrap Studio. So we start by a row at the top and then um, I've got this image called deer and we'll just pop that in on the right hand side. Um, so we have, uh, we just drag and drop that in to the row by default it goes to the left so if we uh, look on the click on the image there um, what we do then is convert HTML find the custom code there and <clears throat> just edit the code and in here we can actually put a style uh, and do it from here but the best way to do it is just put in a class and I'm going to call that there um, and this is probably the best way it used to be center with an html tags but this seems to be the the way everybody's going um even though the center tag still works most of the time so uh just apply that and we go to the the styles and then we put in here um display okay so we put that display and we put that uh, colon and we're going to put that in into a block and then we just going to put that there put a semicolon and then go and margin um margin left we just put auto and then we see that goes to the right hand side by default but then we're going to put in margin right and then we're going to put auto for that and they, uh, there you see it's all center now so that's basically how you uh, send the images and that. That's the code. Um, and it's a good trick really to learn because uh, putting uh, images and text can be a little tricky at times um, if you don't really know what you're doing. Uh, we just preview that and put it in Microsoft Edge. And there you see it's perfectly centralized now. Okay, so for that's basically what you do on that. So for uh, paragraphs, for example, put another row in, uh, just drag and drop that one in there. And we go for a paragraph and uh, we, we just, uh, it's quite similar actually, how you, you just get everything centralized in this as well. So we just do the convert HTML and again, the custom code underneath and edit code. And there you see the paragraph. What I'm going to do is get lorem ipsum and pinch some of that and copy and paste it in there. Again, control V um, for Bootstrap Studio because they forgot about doing the right click thing. So there you have the uh, lorem and that's at 100% but to get it centralized uh, and for it to be able to be seen properly in this demonstration, we just put, um, say for example, we'll put width and I think I'll put 50% for that one. Okay. Semicolon. And say it goes to the left. And again, margin uh, margin left. And again, auto, which goes to the right, like we saw in the, uh, the image as well. And we then just do margin right, auto. And there we see that it's back in centralized. Um, and that is how you, you do it. The margin autos are very important. And another thing that um, you do here is text align and center as well, which gives you the same thing. And again, do that semicolon. And as you see, we'll do it preview, open the browser. And there, that's looking quite neat. And that's uh, that's basically how you would uh, how you would do that. So I hope you've uh, hope you've learned something from that and uh, enjoyed this video. And it just shows uh, little tricks and uh, things how to centralize things. So again, thanks for watching and thanks for listening.